Hello, I'm ABX Cat, and welcome back to another live stream on the internet. Today I'm going to be playing some Assault Android Cactus. That's a very bizarre name, AAC, if you wanted to abbreviate. And we're going to be doing the important work of, because this is a free game with gold, but it's a free game with gold of something like a 2.9 star rating on the Xbox Store. And usually, you might dismiss a game like that out of hand, but it looks really interesting. Like, look at this art style, look at that logo. You have to wonder if there's something more to it. So in today's video, we'll be doing a fun for the first ever time, by the way, morning exclusive, wait, morning exclusive, exclusive morning stream. This is being done at 8 a.m. UK time, which means that if you live in Asia or Australia or, you know, the, that side of the world, the Eastern Hemisphere, then this is actually the correct time zone for you. I know this sucks for American viewers, which, uh, you know, we'll see if that reflects in the uh, the view counts or the whatever else, but it is mostly just like kind of a fun experiment. And if you if you want to see more of this, like the video and let me know because it helps out the channel a lot and lets me know you want to see more live streams in the AM, or I guess AM for me. It might be PM for you, but you know, AM in GMT, which is obviously the greatest master time uh, <laughs> that does exist. So yeah, we've been playing some uh, Assault Android Cactus. Uh, first though, we want to, uh, before we do any of that, we're going to turn down the music volume a little bit because there's a chance that it like <laughs> messes up YouTube's, uh, you know, because some people just claim like music from games they didn't even, you know, like have a right to claim for just because they're, you know, like, it's a thing music publishers do on YouTube. But yeah, let's do this. So as you can see, uh, it looks like it's a multiplayer or single player game. I I like it when you've got a choice going on. Although actually, again, so I, I love the art style in this game. It's just, it's pleasing, right? Even the most re realistic game in the world would not look that good. I've got stun on subtitles. That's what I should have done. Hello, by the way, everyone. Hi, hi, hi. Hello. You enjoying the uh, first ever AM live stream? You getting something from this? Should I do more AM live streams? I can't hear it for this either, by the way. I'm going to quickly turn it up. What? What is this game? Like, and submit a mission failed report? I hate those the visuals look great, but the way the voices are done and the way the animations are, like, it's it's meant to look like a cool action sequence, but it's just like, eh, eh. <laughs> it's pretty lazy in that way. Uh, love from Germany says Jacob H. Love right back to Germany. Two o seven a.m. says Ochiru Kikari. You, do, you gotta, you gotta give some props to the people in America that have stayed up to watch this. Like, 10 out of 10 to you, right? TBH and streams are a little bit more fun. You can watch them with your cereal if you live in the UK or Europe. Um, played it yesterday. Okay, so, it looks like it's a twin stick shooter, because it's left stick to move, right stick to aim, RT to shoot. So, a Geometry Wars, or any game like that. Should be, oh, I guess Dead Ops Arcade is probably one of the more famous examples these days. But, um, keep fighting, we can push the advantage. So it looks like it's, uh, maybe that's why people don't like it, because it, like, pretends to be really important, and then it's very basic. Also, I can't turn on subtitles, so I guess we'll just do it like this then. So yeah, as you can see, fairly basic game in terms of gameplay. Uh, but let's talk about morning quickly, because, yeah, I, I feel like morning really is just, like, uh, my donation was missed. Oh, I'm sorry! Uh, Honin Zombie, thank you so much for the £2.99 super chat. Uh, always appreciated. Um, I it didn't show up. I guess my, my PC volume is really low. I need to turn up so I hear those donations. They're the most important thing to hear. But yeah, big thank you Honin Zombie uh, for the £2.99. Starting, starting everyone's favourite uh, thing in a... Oh, jeez. You get multiple guns it seems then. So secondary weapons, overheat. So you have to switch between weapons. So... Okay, you can see in the top left, now I'm using a bullet gun until I press RB and then I switch to a flamethrower, which is better. And that's the thing. And then you can pick up more weapons and power-ups and... Okay, you, you get where this is going, I think. It's <laughs> it's fairly basic stuff. And you can also use a flamethrower at the same time. So yeah, it looks like it's a basic arcade game play idea that's been turned into a full game. But I still want to know what makes people hate this, because this is a fun-looking game. Like, this is just a tutorial. I'm doing pretty okay with it. Um, do you have your 9 a.m. burgers to get? Everyone got so confused, because, yeah, okay, so, uh, if you don't follow my Twitter, one, yeah, should be, <laughs> no, but, uh, if you don't follow my Twitter, um, I've been cooking a lot in the mornings recently, because I've been waking up at 4 a.m. because my body is just broken, um, pro tip, don't go to New Zealand, uh, unless you got, like, 
a plan to fix your body when you come back. But uh, yeah, my body's been broken recently. I've been waking up at four. So by the time it's nine or 10 a.m., I'm ready for lunch, not just breakfast, yeah, lunch. And uh, because of that, I, I've been cooking a lot. I made Chinese stir fry for breakfast, lunch thing yesterday. Uh, burgers day before that. I don't know why that offends people because like, you can eat any meal you like any time of day and it's just as good. If anything, later on the day, the only things that I enjoy are like ice creams and like, you know, like you, there's, there, sometimes later I want different foods only, but in the morning any food will do. Pizza, yeah. McDonald's breakfast, yeah. And any breakfast will do. Um, this is the weirdest looking like game ever. It looks somewhere between like a kids TV show and like, like look at, look at that redhead character that's talking right now. She looks like she could teach me about the value of friendship, you know? But instead we're here like, on this space mission. Oh, there we go. Title drop. <laughs> so yeah, I get to pick whichever one I want to play as. Oh, and they all have different uh, things. Uh, to tempt Ivan to give it fiver. Thank you so much, Horned Zombie, for the £4.99 super chat. It's green, so it stays at the top of the thing. I didn't realize it was five that you had to do to put at the top. So as you can see, his message will be visible up there the whole time. That's pretty cool. But uh, th that tempts Ivan to give me a fiver. You know what? I'm down with people donating if it helps other people donate. That's That seems like a win-win for me, doesn't it? Uh, big thank you to the Haunted Zombie. I think I want to play as, um, like, actually, you know, I'll play as the Redhead. Like, Cannonball, Seeker. Sounds fun to me. Oh, this, like, this game looks like it's, like, a cross between, again, like, simple platform game. Oh, sorry, simple. Marimanic donated one pound, who says... All streams are really fun, although my eyes, eyelashes are really annoying me as they aren't part, part, as they aren't partially falling out. Do you have that thing in the morning where like you can't see because like your eyes just aren't used to be functioning? Because to me it's the worst thing in the world. I have like genuine nightmares where I just like can't see fully and it like affects my life and messes with me. It's, it's terrible. Um, so I can't equals Valve confirms this chick from State Farm. <laughs> So yeah, when, okay, so this is in reference to the fact that the live stream started. Oh god, I'm gonna take some damage. Uh, this is in reference uh, into the fact that the live stream started. Uh, I wouldn't say late, but like, you know, I, I, I delayed it like five minutes after it started. So whenever, okay, pro tip, if you wanna watch Toycat streams and you're getting ready there and you see the timer, always add a few minutes to the timer if you wanna know how long it's actually gonna take. Because, um, oh, big thank you. Oh, there we go, it's on the screen now. Thank you, Jake from State Farm. Appreciate the super chat here. Good to, good to see you rolling in there. But um, yeah, basically it's just like, you know, that I want to give people a rough idea of when to expect it, but there's always some delay that gets the stream going and like, I'd rather start the stream four minutes later and be ready than like rush start it at five minutes. Because one thing a lot of YouTubers do is they start like um, music playing on the stream, right? But then that makes the video afterwards like suck. Harrison. Have you ever watched a video, a, a live stream where you just have to like skip through like 20 minutes of, you know, music and it's like, this isn't, this isn't what I'm here for. Why didn't you just start the stream when it was ready? And plus, when the music starts playing, there's no like timer, so you have no even idea. Anyway, it's, it's a very confusing thing. Anyway, a big thank you just to Guy from Hungary, who says uh, hi to a cat from Hungary, and donates to 699 Hungarian foreigners. By the way, that was a really fun level. I like that a lot, like, so much I got an S rank. Ah, uh, not, not more than this, right? If that's a thing. Uh, thank you for the 699... Hi, Toy Cat from Hungary. <laughs> thank you for the, uh, Hungarian forums. I'm actually, I, I keep wanting to go to Hungary. Like, it's been on my list forever. It just keeps, like, not coming up as, like... Because I, I have Hungarian money, which I bought. Uh, just to go there. And now, I have even more. Uh, pro tip, by the way, look up the Hungarian foreign. It's the most ridiculous looking currency. And also, it, like, comes in really weird. It's also, oh! You get precisely one bullet with the, look, I get one of these. Do you see that? I get fire. One huge cannonball, it seems. Which is good, it can take down one enemy, but it seems like excessively underpowered. In my I guess we're gonna switch back out to it. Fire it over there. Oh, there we go. So yeah, this is, this is actually a pretty fun game. Like, I, I don't see why this, um, I don't see why this is uh, so widely hated. It seems like it's a solid gameplay mechanic taken into the Xbox days. Maybe people play paid, uh, paid full price for this, expecting like a fully featured game, and then they get like an arcade game I could see, maybe. But especially given, again, this game is free if you have Xbox Live Gold right now. At that price point, you know, at the price point of zero, I can recommend this wholeheartedly, I think. But again, maybe we'll hate it as we get further in. It's not a so can't stream, not fashion too late. 
I should totally change the motto to that, Haunted Zombie. It does, um... It does sound a lot better to say fashionably late than to say, oh, it's not a toy cat streamer less than some time. But I mean, it's, it's the basic truth, right? Like, they're just... I think scheduling things in life... Uh, being on time to things means you have to do them a little bit worse. And that's why you usually try to show up early. But if I started streams... People would rather me start streams late than early. Because some people will show up before 8, and if I start at 7.54, for instance, they'll be like, wait, I've just missed 4 minutes? See, I'd, I'd much rather... It's... Okay, if you're... If people are waiting on you, it's better to be early than late. But if you're waiting on people, it's better to be late than early. That makes sense, I think. If you're a bus driver... Oh, come on. Oh, I want to know what's after S-rank now. Side note, I think I'm, like, second best ranked. Oh, that's all my friends this. I thought it was in the world. I was like, I'm, I'm good at this, apparently. So, yeah. It it seems like the... I will say, though, it seems like the levels, like, there doesn't seem to be too huge a difference. There's no real strategy besides just spam spam right trigger, fire in different directions. Also, good to see you, Kit Kats. Uh, she says, well, I'm here. Good to see you. Also, by the way, I thank you for the super chat. Morning, zombie. They got to mention it. I always like to mention that. It's like, uh, you know, that's, that's what makes the streams, uh go on or whatever. Uh, you know, normal videos work on it. Streams work on uh, the, the very bizarre uh, interactions of... Because, I, I mean, live chat is like... It's a concept that came out with, like, I think it was Justin TV that was the first live stream site. It might have been. But, you know, it was one of those, um, you know, sites that was designed to, like, stream your life. And the idea of, like, a chat influencing video... Like, imagine if this existed on the TV days and how much you'd hate like, I, I feel like it only works on YouTube and the internet because you have, like, these specific communities. And I, and I I think a lot sometimes about how, like, chat could be terrible and would be terrible in most situations. But it works just because, you know, like, the internet kind of works. Like also, good to see you in the morning. Oh, okay, we've got some fiery stuff in the internet. Yeah, I think, I think this is also a really fun game for me to play, like, in the morning so we can talk about stuff. Like, you know, what's the best breakfast in the world? Or, um... Uh, like the questions from um, Jacob, who says it's only fifteen dollars. Uh, no, it's free. Uh, it says it's fifteen dollars, but it's free if you have gold. I don't know why it says it's fifteen dollars still. I think it's making you feel like you get more value. Um, oh, I died. I thought that top thing up there was my health, but apparently my health is in the top left. Oh, I'm I'm so dead. This is this is. <laughs> I mean, it's like playing a game of zombies or something where you're just trying to dodge the horde that you're also trying to shoot and kill at the same time. So if we wait in this corner for a little bit and just fire that way, we'll tear them all up. We'll get it all done. Oh, but there's a, there's a battery limit for my weapon. Okay. Interesting game. We did it, though. Um, like, a question's from Jake from State Farm who says, do you watch anime? I want to beat that guy above me, like, unbated spade 688. Who does he think he is beating me? Um, but yeah, do I watch anime? I don't watch any animes. <clears throat> I watched, um, sorry, my voice sucks. Uh, I watched, uh, what's it called? Death Note. But just because I was, like, intrigued by the concept. And I'm also watching, um, I watched One Punch, Punch Man, but it just wasn't really my thing. I wanted it to be, but it just wasn't. So we're gonna shoot on Mega over there. Okay, so the Mega can go through enemies if it can kill them. Okay, that's useful to know. Also, it seems like you need power-ups to do any real damage. Like, it seems like I'm just going crazy slow. Big thank you, uh, Mr. Gaming, for the Australian. Australian? Did I do it right? Australian? Yeah, Australian. You'll like, you'll say like an I that isn't quite an I. Um, what did you have for breakfast in New Zealand? Well, I was in New Zealand the whole week. Honestly, what it would be is like, I'd wake up at 4 a.m. and there wouldn't be any breakfast places open when I was in the smaller villages. Cities. Um, and, you should um, go to Hungary. It's a beautiful country. Thank you so much, by the way, uh, just a guy for the Hungarian foreign donation. And he says I should go to Hungary. And I, again, I want to go to Hungary because it's country. Oh, well, I, I guess not because it's beautiful. Like Budapest is a beautiful city, and there's a bunch of stuff there I want to do. But uh, yeah, I really want to go to hung uh, Hungary. And your Hungarian foreigns will help me go there. I have no idea what the exchange rate is, by the way, but I know it's like pretty confusing. Um, but I appreciate the 700 Hungarian foreign regardless, because I know that that's worth uh, 700 Hungarian foreign skier, whatever that is. Uh, and <laughs> Again, it always seems offensive to say real currency, but like, let's just say international currency, right? Uh, you know, the dollars or whatever. 
Uh, thank you for the donations, uh, both of you. And we'll have breakfast in New Zealand. Uh, I had Mc no wait, not McDonald's breakfast. I had McDonald's breakfast one day because it was the only place that was open. Uh, I had because you can eat that like all day round there. I had. Um, I honestly can't remember most of the other days. I remember. Oh wait, there's these things. Uh, Capri Oreos. They're like Oreos surrounded by Capri chocolate. They're solidly pretty good. Um, and I had some of those. Uh, one day, just because I, again, I woke up. Oh, I, I actually failed a level. Battery depleted. So I'm going to try a different Android. It looks like you do have to be kind of careful about this. So I'll use a shotgun and the plasma. Actually, not. Yeah, we'll be coral. You know, get aquatic theme going on here. Uh, yeah, I, I, I like the, the theming of this game. I like everything else like that. It does feel a bit weird to make this a, a fully fledged you know, retail game. But it works at the same time, so. No huge issues there. Okay, so. Yeah, using the shotgun is a very different tactic. You only get to fire, like, once every, like, second and a half, so you advance that. By the way, big thank you, Mr. Gaming, probably $1.50 Australian Super Chat. Everyone's so generous in the, uh, the AM. Uh, but yeah, no, I was, I was thinking, like, the, the interesting thing about the morning is it's the one time a day everyone agrees, like, you kind of have to be productive at some point, right? Like, I, I'd say the world as a whole caters more and more to fun later on in the day, which is good if you, if you, you want this fun. But I mean, oh man, these dodging these bullets is getting harder. Okay, this is plasma field. But, um, yeah, the, the day, I, I would say, like, as the day goes on, more and more things cater towards, like, you can have fun. And in the morning, it's like, get some stuff done. And personally, I really like the balance of, like, get more stuff done, but then, then have fun later. And the morning, if you don't wake up in the morning, though, you wake up when everyone else is, like, already in their fun phase. And you might be thinking, like, no, 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 you're crazy to a cat. What are you even talking about there? But think about it. Like, if you go to a restaurant... Oh, wait, I'm, my battery completed. Oh, so the battery can kill you as well. I don't know why that killed me. But it did. But, um, I play Holly. I liked Holly, actually. Um, I'll, I'll give it a try again. Assuming it was Holly that I was just playing. Um, but yeah, so, uh, oh, I've got to make sure I get those little, little orbs, apparently. They're important. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like the later on the day, like, when you go to a restaurant, for instance, they're, they're only open after, like, 5 p.m. in most cases, because they want you to have that wonderful experience or whatever. Um, that's the reason, like, most, I guess, let's put it, like, adult activities, like clubbing or whatever, they open at like 4 a.m. because they they want the very last portion of your day. They want that last two hours before you go to bed. Um, they want you thinking about it all day or something or a week ago. I, I know that's that's my take on it. People aren't generous. They're probably half conscious. It says end of five five. <laughs> He's saying that's why people uh, super chat. I mean, like I I don't know about you, but if you're half conscious in the morning, then you're definitely living your life wrong, and you need to like. Because this, this is a thing I used to do all during school, just like, I was not a- Also, I'm getting these batteries, but they're just not recharging. Battery over here. Like, okay, whatever. You just gotta get one every now and then, it seems. But, um, yeah, um, the, uh, the thing is, so it goes down regardless of whether I'm actually, um, using it or not. But, um, yeah, the thing is, if you're, like, if you're so tired in the morning that you're not functioning, I think that means you're not getting enough sleep, generally speaking. Okay, I need to get that battery. I think that usually means you're not getting enough sleep. Because um, I used to be like that. And as soon as I started just giving myself like eight hours to sleep, I died again. Then suddenly, like, I was much more functional in the days. And I could think, you know, you know it's, it's amazing, like, how much you can get done without sleeping. And if you if you realize how amazing it is, how much you can do without sleep, think about how much you can do. Oh, what? The power thing is really messing me up. I think I need to use a more basic character. Because I think maybe... Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure what's going on there. We'll play as uh, Cactus, though, because she's from the game title. Um, thank you for... Oh, by the way, uh, thank you to Chanka the Lord for the $1.99 Super Chat. Uh, I'm actually stuck on this level already. Like, level 4, it's gone me down. Um, but uh, they say, hi, how are you? I'm doing pretty good this morning, actually, to Chanka. I'll be honest, I guess it's not really this morning for me, because I woke up, like, four hours ago or something like that. But, um, yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm doing really good. Uh, I'm, I mean, I'm flying later today. Because uh, uh, it's the last... No, wait, because today 
Because this week we know there's no new stuff happening, but we're like 80% certain something huge is happening next week. Uh, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to, you know, get my, my important overseas stuff done uh, today because I'm catching a flight. I'm uh, meeting my girlfriend. It's going to be a fun time. Or a terrible time. Could be either, you know. Um, <laughs> but no, that's, that's, uh, that's what I'm doing today. It's going to be good. Looking forward to it. I, honestly, I like flying regardless of what happens. Like, it's just a, it's an interesting experience to me. Uh, even, even when it's like a 90 minute flight, there's you know, something, something nice about it. At least to me. So, um, no battery drop again. I, I wonder why that is, like, because it's clearly not just random drops, because that battery's going down all the time, but it's not going down right now, so. I'm going to work out what makes the battery. Oh, 373. Okay, so you, you donated roughly two, no wait, about 1.9, but thanks so much for the roughly, I thought it was like 400 for the pound, but I guess I was not too far off with that. Because uh, I, I remember I, I, got, I have 500 and it's worth barely more than uh, a couple of dollars or something like that. Uh, on behalf of RPG Open. Thank you so much, uh, Horn and Zombie. Thank you. Okay, we got like, the craziest, craziest donation train in the morning. See, again, people are generous in the mornings or they're not getting enough sleep. And honestly, whichever one it is, thank you. Um, <laughs> okay, switch out to the plane bro. Burn these people. Um, so, yeah, big thank, thank you to RPG Ivan for his uh, generous four pound, three pound 99 uh, super chat. And also to just a guy, and also to Yossi Yossi, we're just rolling in the super chats today, right? It seems like you can go down as many times as you want without any real uh, downsides. Oh, there we go. We're going to burn everyone, just to charge them there. Burn them all. Again, this level is surprisingly hard. We went from, like, I don't need to think about this, to, oh my god, I, I'm going to die if I don't think about this. In such a short amount of time, too. Okay, we're going to go in that and just burn. Let's do it. Let's do it. There we go. I did it. Game over. Okay, we finally got it done. It took like three attempts though. I'm gonna get like a terrible rank. Oh, not C. Okay, I'll take a B. Almost as good as All Saints Dragon. And better than Big Mike 168. <laughs> I guess next we got like a big boss fight or whatever going on. I wonder if you can put APKs on these types of Android. Uh, says Mega vs. Prime. <laughs> hey, I get your joke. It took me a minute though. I was like, what is this? And then. So Embryo. Rats. Sneaky, filthy rats. Scurrying around my horde. Here is another one. I don't know why he's got this accent, but he does. A nasty little stowaway. I'll toss you out the airlock like all the... I guess be, he'd be talking like a robot, right? I'll toss you out the airlock like all the other vermin. Don't call me... Oh, wait. I'm... Whatever. Uh, officer of the law. Oh, I'm, I'm an officer of the law. Let's news to you. I guess I'm a, a police officer guy. So, yeah, I think the idea for boss level in a game like this is actually quite a cool idea. Like, don't get me wrong. It will probably suck. But it's a fun idea. Um, but a donation away, a donation away keeps the twig cat away. I mean, in the sense that it, when you donate, it does help me to do the one of my favorite dream slash hobby of traveling, and that does keep me away from the country. It is very much true that a donation away keeps the twig cat. I guess away. I mean, away in an arguably different sense each time. But still a win. Also, this is actually a pretty easy boss level. Like, um, you ever attack from a distance like this? Like, honestly? Oh, God, oh, okay. <laughs> so we'll just attack from a distance. Um, going in and burn. There we go. Yeah, it seems like, okay, it's, it's an easy enough boss fight. I don't think I'm going to lose this. Switch back out. Do some burning. Yeah, the flamethrower is just crazy. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I died. Should not have... Not have raised that. Oh, Chris is with it. Oh, ow. Okay, so yeah, I, th I think you'll be a lot more careful than I've been this entire time. So you'll you'll learn the patterns. You'll avoid the bullets, and you go up, you up fast, and you got a flame throw. just like that. But what if you're made of money? Do you mean like made of money in the sense of like Midas's touch, or do you mean made of money as in like rich? Because I feel like very different thing right there, right? Ivan, then expect to understand additions for the so much space right now. Oh, space. Uh, do you plan on doing a Fortnite season five stream, or are you done with it? Honestly, I'm just done with Fortnite, and I know that's like I know my reason is like the most attending to people. Like I don't know, I'm, I'm just I'm I'm in the market for another battle game. I'm not. Uh, 
It's weird how many times you can die and get back up. As long as your back is dead, I guess. Oh, I did it, by the way. You have the right to remain silent. Well, I mean, I, I literally killed. You know, you can't kill someone and then be like, ho, ho, ho. I'm really the good police officer. No, you, you, you killed that person. That's terrible. You sound like an operator. Like a, what type of operator? Like on the phone? I might fall here, but do not underestimate the combined might of the other section lords. Okay, so there's, there's a lord for each section of the ship. Basically, there's just more bosses coming right up. Please tell me I beat, yeah, I beat him. There we go, we're all good. I'm good at this. Um, so, uh, what about Toy Cat Battle Royale? I'd love a Toy Cat Battle Royale. Also, um, thank you, you are welcome. Uh, biggest fan, cool to see you, Mr. Mr. Biggest Fan. However, oh wait, I, lo I unlocked a new, a new thing. Okay, let's be this. That sounds fun. As we move to the next section. Oh, you actually, there's a teleporter. And you slowly like, have to move through it. So let's try new, new zone. See if this is any good. Um, Robo Toy Cat voice. Robo Toy Cat does not understand. No, I, I think that in, in Let's Plays and stuff, so I guess live stream's kind of like a Let's Play, right? It's like a first impression rundown, letting you know like, is this thing something that I appreciate? You know, all that sort of stuff. Oh, what is this? But uh, in Let's Plays, there's always this like big question of like, should you do voices for characters? Because 99% of the time it's like, you know, cringe supreme or whatever. Um, but it's also like, what are you gonna do to read text on the live stream, on like on the video? And I think the good compromise is to like go deliberately terrible. Like do voices so bad that it adds to the character or makes the character worse. You know, I, I think taking something away is just as important as adding something to 100 cats drop onto a toy and use grab weapons. You know, I would be down with a, a battery hour where you play as a cat. Like maybe like, I, I can't actually work out any legitimate ways to make that work. But you know, I want to see it regardless. Really gonna need that, I think. So yeah, I guess the entire game is really just about getting batteries. You can die as much as you like, as long as you get these batteries when they go. And I guess that thing at the top is like a timer, limiting how long you can go. Also, <laughs> I think I think these bees are meant to be way harder than they are, but like, look how easy this is. It's just like, oh, it's just like waving a flashlight at them. Like, look at that chain go up. Too. I'm gonna get the high score for this level, I reckon. It's gonna be the best. Everybody loves getting high school. Fire this nonsense again. Oh, what is what is happening? The problem with games where they try to make too much action on screen like this is like you just at some point you just stop understanding like Okay, so I'm firing my laser against some green robots. All good stuff. Nintendo Battery Out would be cool. I would love Nintendo Battery Out. I don't like instead of Super Smash Brothers, make Super Battery Out Brothers. But that's a cover really catch. But like, honestly, I feel like Nintendo, if they capitalized on trends like that, they could make the best battery out by such a long shot. They would they would define the genre. Like how Super Smash Bros. is like one of the most popular fighting games, because it's barely even a fighting game. Uh, in the same way, and Mario Kart's the best racing game for a lot of people, even though it's barely a racing game. I feel like they could define the battery out. Also, Cat Royale is RPG Ivan's idea. I totally love Cat Royale. Uh, which actually that sound cattle royale makes it sound like you're playing like a cow bat royale like oh We're on a good old uh, beef farm right here playing cattle royale Oh, yeah, if you want to if you want to join the discord discord.gg slash toy cat Actually is it IBX toy cat? No, it's toy cat. Uh, discord.gg slash toy cat. There you go. Fun fact you can Join it. You can see all the best toy cat related memes and news and everything else. Oh, there's no remaining counter. That's nice. Little, little point, but it's been nice anyway. Okay, after that chain from earlier, I should totally be top of the leaderboard. Yeah, look at that. Actually, wait, I'm top of the leaderboard, but by default, I guess no one else has played this. Did everyone just stop playing after the first boss? Was that the point where they decided this is too far? So yeah, honestly, you can see how there's like, a swarm store, like every, every level has a different icon going on above it. This is Atmospheric Generator, and then there's a new boss every five levels. 
But I'm gonna be honest, there's a part of me that's just like, you know, this is an interesting game and all. But it doesn't, oh, we unlocked some stuff. Should we give it a, should we give it a whirl? Let's, let's play Daily Drive. Daily Drive, what does that even mean? Oh, it's a, it's a new level every day, one assumes. And we'll play as uh, Lemon, because I haven't given that a shot. But yeah, um, I would say so far the game is a really great blast while it's free. Oh, so you go and do a new level. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was good. Um, but yeah, I'd say so far the game, really solid bit of fun. But I think there's not really much that it can do to like extend the fun. Also, this is a terrible weapon for this boss. I'd like to just briefly make. Oh man, I'm down again. So yeah, pro tip. Don't, don't be using this. Join the Discord and see me. That's right, not only can you get Twin Cat memes, you got your boy RPG Ivan, Haunting Zombie. Yeah, like at, as, a, as a free game, this game is a great deal. As a, as a paid game, I'd see how quickly you'd be like, I regret spending money on this. I don't want to play this anymore. Because, uh, again, right, so now, right now, we're something like 30-ish minutes in. And I think I've experienced the entirety of the game just well. Like, I think... I'm having a little bit of fun with it right now. But there's nothing... Oh, man. <laughs> there's nothing new, at least, with every new thing I do. And I feel like when you buy a game sometimes, you want to have different experiences. You want it, you know, you want it to surprise you a little bit sometimes. You know, people, there's a really interesting thing that like people like to be surprised consistently right like people love movies with twists so you like you expect the twist and even when you expect the twist you love the twist because you love that you could have been surprised by it that's all that really matters so it seems like we can switch out to the rockets like actually surprisingly frequently oh no it's, it's got a charge okay but yeah against this boss it seems like the best thing to do is just wait for rockets it's kind of from a distance you said rocket rockets Pieces, yeah. When there's a button that you should cut. That seems like good advice. So if you're a surgeon again. You know, I, that, that, I bet that is surgeon advice, right? If there's a button, then don't cut. If there's a maybe, then... Uh, I don't know, cover them in gravy. I'm, I'm not sure the, the surgeon advice for that. I'm about to die if I can't finish this. And he's like so close to dead. Come on, come on, no. Did I die? Did you see the health bar on that thing? That's not, that's not fair. That, that, that's cheesy. I want to know what happens when you beat this daily drive, though. So we're going to go back for it. One player. I'll play as, like, the best character for it. I'll just probably pack this. Just so we can cheese through this. Someone asked what game I was playing. One of the things that... So, chat, can you, can you help me understand this one? One of the things that drives me insane on the internet is when people ask questions that have already been answered. And you know, that's fine if it hasn't been answered recently. But if people are, people ask questions that are answered by the thing they're asking questions about. So like, I put out a tweet saying I'm streaming in 12 hours, and someone said, did you mean to put the stream time up for 12 hours? And it's like, yes, I just tweeted that. Or like, um, you know, sometimes I'll, uh, you know, like, when we're playing, you know, this game right now, it says it in the title. That's the whole point of the stream. Someone's like, what, what game is this? It's like, the, 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 the thing you had to click to get here. The title, the thumbnail. Um, I don't know, it just, it makes me question. What, what do you think the solution to that is? Or do you, what do, why do you think people do that? Because it's been like, eroding at my sanity for a while now. And I'm not, I, I want to like, this is therapy basically. Therapy of Toy Can. It's 8 a.m. so. Let's have a good old perfect session. Make Toy Cat's life a bit better. Let's burn this guy. There we go. Now we'll get away. Oh, no, if you get away. There's like this perfect medium distance you want to be away from while he does this. That's, that's how you do this. Also, there's a yellow thing up here. Also, the battery, it only lasts so long and then it vanishes. So we'll just spam it from a distance. See, look, this is fun. You're like, like going between the waves. This is an enemy pattern that I can get down with, actually. Oh. And it's hard to get close to him. There we go. He's down again. Uh, 42. So, we can. What is the meaning of life? It's a suicidal pick. 
Uh, well, 42 is the easy answer, like Mary Minion says. I think the meaning of life is what you make it. I say this a bunch, but life, life is about the journey, not the destination. And I guess you've just got to find... I, know, I, I guess, like, pick a random girl. Just be like, I want to stroke every single cow and all that kind of stuff. Even if you don't succeed the, on the girl. I feel like it's at least a fun thing to have. Uh, working towards something that you better. I guess every brain's wired differently, though. Maybe some people, the one thing they love more than anything else is, like, um, the feeling that they've helped someone else. Or maybe it's the feeling that you... You know, I, I wonder, like, if someone... Oh, God, we're gonna die. Come on, I need that battery. I need... No. No, this isn't fair. This isn't fair. This isn't fair. Okay. It's fair. <laughs> I just want to know what happens when you beat the dating drive. I'm playing, playing through all of this just to see what this does. So, yeah, usually I stream 12 hours from when this stream started. But uh, this is a morning stream just because, you know, doing something a little bit fun and different. Um, but yeah, because also I'm I'm away later on in the day, and I, I've said for a while now like I really want to do a stream in the morning, but I've just never got around to it. So I figured, given that my sleep schedule is basically Asia slash Australia time anyway, why not do a stream in matches then? Because I'm going to sleep at like oh god, I need to get the battery now. Thank you very much. Burn everyone, nice and easy. So it's weird, because health doesn't even seem to matter in this game for anything but score. It seems like the only thing that matters is battery, which is a random drop. But it can't actually be a random drop, so I wonder what the logic is for that. Uh, so, it seems this mode is just a gauntlet, so it's now made. But it's called Daily Drive. There's one called Infinity Drive, which is like, okay, this is, this is like, you know, you play for as long as you can survive. But then what would Daily Drive be? And what's the reward for doing it? Because there's clearly an end at some point. I just want to know where it is. Oh wait, maybe what it is. I think we're playing through the story campaign, but backwards. So maybe it's just every level we've unlocked so far. Oh god, I'm, I'm dying so bad. Probably not a good thing. Pro tip, don't die. That's how you do better games. I guess we're going to burn everything in front of me. Oh, yeah, the laser kills you. Just gonna burn everything, praying we had a battery. There's one up there. You can't do it. See, I, I think that's every level in the story but backwards. I can't do it. I'm just not not skilled enough. Uh link to Cat Royale. Um Thank you for caring so much. Stream Australian time. I know you did it for me and no one else. It was purely for you, RPG Ivan, yeah. Too early, dude, way too early. I like to believe you've just woken up and you're like, man, this notification. It's just too much for me, man. Too much for me. So we're gonna try Infinity Drive now. Um, Infinity Drive is no doubt gonna be endless, but I want to see like what makes it interesting then, because the the story already feels kind of endless to me. So like, if you make it more endless, what what does that really achieve? You know, like I, I think in life nothing is actually endless. Like as a pro tip, when people say endless, they mean functionally endless. Like, um, for instance, eventually uh, Pac-Man has an endless number of levels, but I think there's a certain number of levels you reach where the game stops being playable because half the screen goes missing. Uh, for instance, the universe is theoretically going to expand infinitely, but, you know, infinitely really means to some point. Um, you might say there's an infinite amount of time left in the universe, but at some point... There's not going to be any atoms left in the universe to observe that, so like, is that still infinite time? All these big questions basically is what I'm saying. Um, okay, we're now... There we go. That's nice. But yeah, there's, there's all these big questions, like, you know, how long is something really going to last? But in games, infinite usually just means, like, ah, oh, there's a lot of content that proceeds to generate. And I, I feel like very few things that are infinite in games are actually worth doing. Like, Minecraft isn't actually infinite. It's functionally infinite. But you never use the infinity of it, right? I don't know. I, my, my point here is that, like, infinite and, like, endless sound like good things, but they're bad. If you could live forever, it'd be tragic because no relationship with another human being could last forever. Even if everyone lived forever, like, I don't know. You know how some marriages last for 80 years? Could a marriage last for 8,000 years? Or 8 billion years? I didn't know. That's like tragic, right? 
That's that's my favorite. Thing. Pro tips: Toy Cat Morning Philosophy. Um, if Toy Cat is late for the stream, will he be wait, late for his wedding? I'll probably be late for my wedding. Yeah. Um, it's like I mean I I feel like it justified to be late for your own wedding. Also, I, you can see how there's like layers of this. Like it's gonna get more and more Larry. Oh, Larry is the word itself. But I guess, I think the Endless in this case is just here because, like, you know, maybe you've beaten the story and you want to play even more. But as someone who hasn't beaten the story, who doesn't really want to play more, it's like, you know, not my thing. I, I like that the level's developing now, like, that, that is quite fun. See, I, I think we're coming to the end of our time with this game. Let me let me give you my, my overview, because, again, this is both a morning stream where we have fun, uh, talk about cattle reals and breakfast. But also, when we're talking about the game as a whole, because if you have an Xbox One, yeah, if you have an Xbox One, and you pay for Xbox Live Gold, which you need to play online, counterintuitively, then uh, this game is free. And as a free game, I would say, if you want a twin stick game, if you want something that just looks like pure carnage, or you've got like spare time, you're just like, I don't know what to do with it, this game is wonderful. If you've got a game that you need to finish, because one of, one of the tragedies of like, modern gaming is that there are a bunch of games that you want to finish but you just don't feel like getting around to. So given that that's the case, I don't know, I'd recommend go play a game you have to finish. Like Super Mario Odyssey, have you got all those moons? Probably not. Uh, have you have you done that thing you want to get done in, in Minecraft? Go, go do that. Have you uh, beaten the newest Tomb Raider game all the way through? I, I really want to actually. I'm waiting for it to be free because I know it will be eventually. But I, I really like the old Tomb Raider. So you know, if you had the new Tomb Raider game, play it. If you, you know, yeah, that's actually a good way to sum up this game. It's a good game, but almost every other game in existence is better. <laughs> Which sounds, and uh, only every other major game is better. Um, so yeah, I, I think that's my good kind of summary here. Like, I'd recommend this game if you have an abundance of time and not enough games to fit it with. If you have too many games and not enough time, then oh, see that's that's kind of cool. And this game is fun; it's interesting, but it's not really my thing. So yeah, games of gold. Let me know what you think. You'll see more of this in the future. Uh, the Pac-Man level counter is only eight bits, so it goes two by five. Yeah, this it's funny. Pretty much every game that claims to be infinite always has the same issue, where infinite means until the level counter overflows. And although we don't have eight bit, uh, eight. Yeah, it's, is it 8-bit? I think it's 8-bit. If we don't have 8-bit integers anymore, a lot of games use, like, a 64-bit integer, which means after 4 point... No, it's... it's Yeah, it's like 4.3 trillion or quadrillion levels, it'll eventually stop. Every number in every video game eventually will break. Like, if I got a 10... If we got to layer 10 trillion, the game would stop working. So, yeah, with that said, this is Assault Android Cactus. Assault Android Cactus? AAC. It's a lot of fun. Oh, I'm on I'm on face cam. So maybe try any other game. But before we go, I have one of these balls. It's from a ball pit from uh, at RT Ball, RT UK Ball. And I found a really fun game. And I'm going to recommend this to you because like this is, wait, webcam time at Toy Cat. So just before we go, the, if you've got a phone, like phones are like six inches now. Here's my phone, by the way. This is some really unflattering lighting. I didn't realize this whole time. I've had lighting on the bottom half of my face and not the top. Pro tip, light yourself from the top. And I've got a light over there, but you can't see it. Like, look how, look how bad this is. Like, it looks like I'm a villain or something. Like, yes, come to the dark side. Um, but yeah, I have one of these balls. Pro tip, go to a ball pit, steal one of these balls. It's probably okay to steal balls from a ball pit, I feel like. And uh, if you've got a phone, you can use it as like a fun little game you play by yourself. Wait, I, I, I want to you. Wait, right, let's, there you go. Let's sit all the way back. And it's, it's the sort of thing that I've been, like, I fidget, I, I fidget, I guess is the word. Um, I kind of, like, goof around. Head of police, I'd like to report crime. Please don't report my, my great, great crime of stealing the bull. I, I'm a bad person, I know. There was thousands of bulls, and as a bad human being, I took one. Just, just that. You shouldn't, you shouldn't steal bulls, but I stole a bull. But like, honestly, as one of these just fun things, I've been in my living room this whole week. I've been doing this nonstop. And do you think I can bear? Oh, oh. <laughs> here's the challenge. 
try and bounce it like 10 or 20 or 15 times in a row. Because I just can't do it. I can always get to like five bounces, then I mess up. So, Tuesday morning streams, they're the best streams. Because where else do you get? Play cat. Oh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, oh, see? I'm sorry I hit the mic for that. But yeah, pro tip bouncing balls. It's a lot of fun. Uh, play this game for a stream. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine one day if we just stream this purely like it's Toy Cat here trying to get the most of this. You have too much free time. What it is is I have a lot of time where I've like I've got to do something, and I need to, like when my when I when my brain is thinking of something, I just need my body to be like doing something, like you know going for a walk, or bouncing a ball. Three, four, five, six. <laughs> I lost the ball, uh, and that's the thing I've got to do. So um, I'm gonna be going now, soon. Uh, I've got a flight to catch in like three or four hours, so I've got to leave the house. When do I have to leave the house? I will leave the house in like uh, 40 minutes, I think. Yeah, 40 ish. 40 ish minutes. <laughs> um, I'm going to have a news video out later today, or like a news ish video. A lot of people are curious. Oh, there we go. Five. No. Okay. I'm going to do this. Ten in a row. Let me prove a point. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Aha! Twelve, thirteen. It counts. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all. Uh, I'm, I'm back. I'm just flying like, like an hour. Meet the girlfriend. Come back. We'll be here Thursday for Thursday's stream, eight p.m. UK time. Uh, might be streaming. No, switch the switch upload will be out by then. I'll be streaming something. <laughs> see you then.